girls and welcome back to the 100 rep six pack abs challenge. We are on day 12. Look at us go. All right, you need your socks for today. So get out that slippery surface and your socks and let's get sliding around as we sculpt your beautiful abs. Okay, this one is a pretty fun one. They're all pretty fun, aren't they? All right, but this one's pretty cool because what you're going to do is you're going to slide those knees in so that they end up at a 90 degree angle and then you're going to push it out, okay? So we are doing 100 of those. You're going to feel those inner thighs work like crazy and of course those low deep abs for that nice flat tight tummy and of course strong confident posture so let's go ahead and get started with my clicker let's try to find the best position for it okay and let's go so pull it in and out pull in and out so what I love about the socks is that it really creates this resistance that you don't normally have, right? So you, there's a lot of resistance in the floor itself. You're gonna feel that back working a lot. Feel those deep, deep core muscles working. Pull in and back. And what you'll notice too is that my shoulders rock slightly over my fingertips and that's good. You wanna be able to use those knuckles, so those hands on the floor, Learn how to use those hands to your benefit, okay? Because most of the time, whew, oh my gosh, we don't really work the hands. We kind of dump all the weight into the wrists and we definitely don't want to do that. Good, so pull in and back, pull in and back, good. I need to take a little breather, <laughs> not gonna lie. Okay, these are pretty tough. So take a breather. If you can keep going, keep going, okay? Well, that was 16, so we've got a few more to go. All right, let's go. Okay, pull in and out. In. So shoulders are over wrists. Again, grip the mat with the fingertips, okay? So you wanna really grip the mat with the fingertips and spiral the biceps forward, triceps back and back, good, in and back, in. I can tell this is going to be a tough one. Okay, we're gonna take breaks, don't worry. Two and one, okay. We're gonna take another little breather here. This one's pretty tough. So you wanna make sure that those hands are nice and strong in the floor, use that core. Okay, here we go. Let's do another 10. We might just need to chunk these out in 10, all right? Let's go. And 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, and one. Okay, take a little breather. I couldn't do the counting thing and the plank all at the same time. So we're just gonna have to keep count this way. Okay, so we're gonna break it up into 10, <laughs> okay? I know you guys, I'm crazy sometimes. Sometimes I'm like, I just have these big audacious goals, you know, but you gotta shoot for the moon, right? Like they say land on the star somewhere or land on the moon. You never know. Okay, here we go. Let's go into our next 10 right here. Again, spread the fingers out wide. Grip the floor with the mat. Use those knuckles, okay? Allow the weight to pour over into the fingers. Good, 10, nine, eight. Push the floor away. Seven, six, five. Slightly dome in the upper back. Four. Squeeze the belly button in, three, two, and one. Take a breather. So we'll do these in sets of 10. It's really important to think of your form. Remember, you're not falling down into your shoulders here like this. You wanna push the floor away, okay? So you wanna spread across the shoulder blades. Great job. Okay, here we go. And 10, nine, eight, Seven, six, keep the biceps forward. 
five. You gotta do it on your own. Four, three, two, and one. Because when I say the biceps forward, triceps back, what happens is a lot of times you end up here like this, right? See how the biceps, the triceps are coming forward and the biceps are spiraling this way. You wanna spiral everything that way. Okay, this is really important. And if you do this, you will get so strong. So think of wrapping the triceps behind you. So even as the legs draw in, it's like these have to go down towards the legs. Okay, here we go. 10 more. Let's go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. All right, little by little, we are getting there. Okay, three more sets of 10. You've got this, I know you can do it. You should be feeling those side, the serratus muscles here, drawing in towards each other, right? Of course, those abs are working. Let's go. And 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, can you do another five? I think you can, ready? Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, so we've just got 15 left. You can do it. So, where can you build your strength? Where can you pull strength from, right? When you push the floor away and you defy gravity, you get lighter. Imagine yourself as light as a feather. Okay, this is it, guys. This is it, you are so strong. I'm so proud of you for sticking it all the way through. Let's go. And. Here we go, our last 10. And nine, eight, count it with me. Seven, you are so strong. Six, you can do this. Five, push the floor away. Four, three, two, finish it out. One hundred, woo! Woo, all right, shake out those wrists. You have a little wrist stretch. Oh my gosh, great, great job. Great job today. Remember that every single time you show up on your mat for one of my workouts, you are getting stronger and more confident every single day. So check in with me using the hashtag StretchyFitAbs. And remember that this entire 30 day challenge is available inside of my StretchyFit app where you can download the videos and watch without Wi Fi. Pretty cool. Plus, there are exclusive workouts, programs, challenges. We've got an amazing community inside of there as well. And I give new workouts every single week. It is amazing. Definitely check that out. The link is in the description box below. So download, you can start your free trial today and I will see you in our next video. Love you so much. Bye.